taking you up on that coffee at McDonald's when we get there. The key to Bala, this is where a lot of rock stars come. Kim Mitchell, everyone. World famous, great Scott. Marty, we must do 88 miles an hour. <laughs> the Bala Bay Hostel, hey watch it, there's a car coming, yeah. dig through that box again and see if I can find another old set of carbides that are better than these. <laughs> I think I've worn these out again. Yeah, this is nasty. But you know what? My suspension's taking it up pretty good now. for another half an hour and still crap. It's not even, it's March break, potentially the busiest week for visitors. And it doesn't appear that this club has even made an effort to groom these trails, they're nasty. Yeah, and these are green on the interactive map, which is just sad. I think if they were smooth, it would be a fun ride through here. It's really scenic and, you know, it's windy. I think it would be just awesome, but this is not even enjoyable at all. down for maintenance or something. If anyone knows, just comment below. But as I mentioned earlier, that I am not rushing back to do this loop ever again. But the, uh, like, look at this, this is pretty nice up in here. No, oh, I'm not talking the trail, it's still shit. I'm talking the scenery is pretty cool. So, don't know. Oh, that was nasty. It's still going too. I can see it up there. Yeah, we were up here the last time we stopped. We this right is there. that intersection where it got shitty right here. And this is how far we've gotten. We cut 12.8 kilometers still till we get to there. Hopefully it gets better. Yeah. 
go up here, we're gonna do this, and we're gonna hit 44. Bang, 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 bang. But this is taking us forever. That was 10 kilometers. I know. It yeah, felt like a thousand kilometers. But it's, she's a toasty one, boys. So where does this go? Is that the gates of hell? Oh, 17. <laughs> it, it goes to Big Shoot and Severn Falls. Oh, that's kind of cool. When we get into Gravenhurst, it'll be better. Yeah. Right in, that's where yeah. we are right there. Right there. Got Bala was cool. Bala was cool. Poor Bala Carning was, cool. was okay. When it's warm out. Jeez. Oh, there goes my water bottle. Yeah. I wondered what was hitting my knee. Would have been that. Yeah. If you go fast, it smooths them out. some speed going into this. This is cool. Very cool. down there. Really cool through here. There's gotta be a look I gotta go up here. Hold on. There's gotta be a lookout. Yeah, Drew. Yep. Oh. Oh my god, people are actually going down there. People were actually going down and climbing up this freaking thing. Well actually it's not it's not that bad, Drew. You should do it. It's actually not that bad. I, will, I think I want to do it. 
It's actually not that bad. No, it won't do it. Shit. Yep. Hold on. Oh. No, no, that's fine. I can't go because it's buried. We gotta lift this up on a firmer snow. Even right here. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a rock right there. Shit. Can we pick it up to If I can, if we can spin it, even if I get it down and go up like that. I think, I think we just keep picking the back end up. If I'm going, if I'm going down like this, I'll be fine. I can get up there. Yeah. I, I just, you're not going anywhere pointing straight up. It's got to be sideways. Think so? Yeah. Let's really lose some weight. Let's get the ass up. Here, let's pack this down. No, not there, right here. Here. One more. Good. One more. One more. There. Oh shit, I broke my handy mirror. Seven years of bad luck. Pinner, pinner, pinner. Okay, we can get going. Woo, that's pretty awesome. Well, I think that it that does look like a, like a Gull Lake Narrows type thing. I still do, I still do want to go down there and come back up though. Seven points for technique. Good. Oh, now I'm sweating. Woo. I don't know who the assholes were off the trail there. Well. Down. Look at this. Oh, yeah, spectacular. Oh, I wonder if people have actually gone down over here and went up over there. That's kind of fun. They did. They went down there. Do a, do a loop.
I guess that's the thing. If you had to wait for that narrow to freeze up, it would be forever before they open. So this is probably the better route. Look at that, it's beautiful. That's the end of that lake, right there. I'm way low on memory right now, so I gotta shoot a little short burst. I just had to delete a couple of videos from the footage today. I see the new Yamaha snowmobiles are in yellow now. God, all these manufacturers like Polaris and Yamaha are copy and skidoo colors. Is that the Sidewinder? Comes with optional blade. Is that your kid? Yeah. He's crashed on that thing. That's awesome. I'm buying a Yamaha next. If you fall asleep like that, I'm buying a Yamaha. <laughs> I was bugging my mom. I had to put my glove on. That must be her dad. So that's her father. That's that's her father and her, their husband's on the Yamaha. Freaking thing, that's cool. See, that's the thing, it's not even a piston bully, it's a nice touring. Yeah, the twins, eh? So, I might have, I might have camera SD card memory and ran out back in Gravenhurst, so I deleted a couple of files. And one of them was crossing Mary Lake this morning. It was a beautiful day, and I just wanted to get you guys home from our Muskoka Magic trip. What I'm doing now is I just turn the camera back on, and I just let it run out. It'll end when we're out of memory, but uh, hopefully we'll be able to make it down to Mary Lake and get a good crossing, because the sun's still bright, the sky's still blue. It's just a beautiful day. It's very warm. I bet it's above zero. It's got to be three or four degrees out right now. I was actually riding with bare hands for a long time on this trip. It was not nice out. Now my hands are all calloused. So I should have brought a pair of mechanics gloves or something. Nice 
to see the groomer though. They're getting beat up pretty bad. There we go. And now you're gonna see, yeah, he turned around. Now you're gonna see the footage I deleted this morning. That was probably blah blah and blah in the whole way. Yeah, it's beautiful. What I like about the 800, those long legs, that wasn't even full of the bar, and I've seen 100 on it, miles an hour. Overall, great day. Would I do the Muskoka Magic Tour again? 